Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, we're going to go through the uh, complete storage sense in Windows 10. Uh, this has been asked by a viewer that has seen some of the videos that I talked about storage sense but I've never went into each category really um, in depth and uh, that's what that viewer would like and I thought it was a good idea because it also is something that a lot of people might actually wonder you know you go and you check out the uh, file explorer and you notice that maybe your uh, hard drive is smaller than you think in space or there's a lot of space used and you're like hmm what is taking all of that space well there's something called storage sense in windows 10 you simply go and right click your start menu button and you go to your settings here in the system setting you'll go into storage and here you will have a quick look at what is taking all of that space it usually takes a certain amount of time because what it will do is actually will show you uh, you know what every uh, folder what every um, section for example all the apps the temporary files and so on uh, and the different folders sometimes, or the main folders actually, and how much space they take. So you'll see that you'll have storage sense information here with your uh, hard drive, your local disk C, and so on. You can actually view other drives too. And if you find that this isn't enough, because of course if you look here at 25 plus 11 plus 2, it's not 72. So there must be more. And of course, the more is under show more categories. This will give you a complete look at what is actually taking all of that space. So here you'll have system reserved. Here you'll have temporary files, apps and features, documents, pictures, other, and then desktop, uh, OneDrive, whatever is downloaded from OneDrive. Uh, videos and maps mail music and other people which is other uh, accounts if you have a uh, um, for example a user account or some local accounts that are on your PC you'll see what other users how much space they are actually using on your PC so all of these categories have of course a lot of them have um, a number of interesting things to look at so you can choose which one and we'll actually look at each category on its own so that you can learn more if you want. But this is the first place to go to see what exactly takes all that space. Once you're here, we'll actually give you the details of what you can do, what you should not do to actually remove space. Now, uh, one of the options is an automatic options. Here you have mine is on. It says storage sense can automatically free up space by getting rid of files you don't need. We will look at this in more details because it could be useful. It could clean up space regularly. But also you might need or might want to be careful in what it can remove or not on your PC. So how to know what is taking off all of that space, storage sense, is the place to go and storage, particularly in Windows 10. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.